People living under a Tacoma freeway will be forced to pack up their things and go somewhere else. The camp underneath Interstate 705 is one of the largest in Pierce County, and there are concerns that it's become a safety hazard. It's gotten so large. King 5's Carol Fallen is live in Tacoma this morning, and Kara, this uh, sweep comes as state lawmakers are working on legislation to help those living uh, like this, right? Yeah, they are working on legislation and since we last spoke with you, we've seen some people moving around clothing items. So some people look like they might be starting to pack up. But again, just a ton of people here at this homeless encampment, which is right across the street from where we are right now here on Puyallup Avenue. So this homeless encampment is actually on Puyallup Avenue, just below Interstate 705. Uh, we're seeing a few people right now. Looks like they're trying to move some of the structures within that encampment. So it looks like some people might be getting ready to go this morning, but there are reports that dozens of people are living in this camp up to 80 people. So we do want to show you some video now from the camp. The city says it has become a public safety hazard after several fires were set in this area. Homeless advocates um, are saying that and they've said this time and time again that the issue with these removals is disrupting these people's lives as they look for somewhere else to go. Well, Governor Jay Inslee is pushing for lawmakers to pass a bill that would get homeless individuals off the streets within months. The bill would require jurisdictions across the state to not just clear homeless camps, but also offer resources and help people transition into safe housing. It is a moral choice and a right choice to transition people out of these encampments. And we have come to accept this as too commonplace. So the bill Inslee is pushing for right now has advanced to the Senate Ways and Means Committee. After that, it goes to the full Senate and then to the House. So another homeless encampment over in Fife is also expected to be removed today. That homeless encampment reports of hundreds of people living there, up to 200 people. And again, here this morning, there are a lot of people moving around. When we arrived earlier, Jim, who's behind the camera, said he saw fire trucks leaving the scene, and we've seen bonfires here as well. So again, this is expected to be cleared out today. Live here in Tacoma, Kira O'Fallon, King 5 News.